People die suddenly as a result of having high blood pressure. Most patients with high blood pressure have no symptoms whatsoever. They don't know anything, but they don't have a problem. But they get a heart attack or a stroke or they die suddenly. And so in light of that, we realize that if about half the people have got raised blood pressure, only half know about it, and that looks like it's the truth, the best thing we can do to try and improve this horrendous burden of disease that blood pressure causes is to improve awareness. So we want a big screening campaign all over the world. And so May Measurement Month was born. And in that month, we want 25 million people, adults, who haven't had their blood pressure measured in the previous year, to come along to one of the thousands of sites that we'll have all over the world. The stimulus for anybody involved with hypertension and its management around the world is that we're going to generate some interesting data. Imagine the data on 25 million adults. So we'll know the mean blood pressure levels for men and women right across the age range in every country that's involved, over 100 countries. There's never been a screening that large for anything anywhere in the world. A key aspect of making May Measurement Month a success is that we need people who are going to volunteer, people who are going to take part and measure the blood pressures on the 25 million people around the world who haven't had it measured in the last year or so. If you are one of those people who would like to join us, please do it now. Each of the 100 or so, more than 100 countries involved, will have a coordinator or committee who's going to organise that. But if you'd like to get involved, then all you have to do is get in touch with us at the ISH. There's a bespoke website for May Measurement Month. Get involved, contact that website and let us know.